Hi guys, I'm the owner of Blueberry, and today we are upgrading from a 29-gallon tank to a, de a Detoff, an Ikea Detoff. So, my dad built it, and right now I'm putting in the old bedding, and plus the new bedding, which I'm spreading out everywhere. <laughs> and then I added all the hides and toys and stuff. It takes a while to do this. Blueberry is a hamster. We've had him for a month and a few days now, and those are the lids my dad built i'm putting the wheel up which was a pain in the butt to get up because it's really tricky it took forever and um blueberry he is a russian campbellsdorf hamster we got him from petco i know that's bad but we do not have any like local shelters that carry hamsters nearby this is an overview of the detail for now i know there's no sand bath which later in the video i'm adding there's a little bit of silence here. And this is Blueberry right here. We are putting him in his detoff right now. He is so cute and he's gotten so much bigger. That's why we have a spinner and a wheel. And there we go. So I put him in and he wandered around, which was super cute. He loved it. He was kind of scared, so he went in his hide. Then he went out and he found his food bowl, of course. He loves food. And then he went straight to eating. I usually don't give him that much food. But he was kind of stressed out, so I wanted to make sure he felt comfortable in his new home. And since he loves food, I gave him a little bit of extra this time. So yeah, he is eating. He's eating a sunflower seed, because that's his favorite. Right now I'm trying to fix the lid, that's why I keep on going out of frame. This was also um, yesterday, because there's going to be a few, a few parts from today. And there he found his water bottle. I put that little platform down so then... The bedding does not sink in. And then he found his wheels, which was super cute because he went over there to hide in the corner, which will, this carries on for a few minutes. I mean, like a few seconds. Okay, sorry. Then after that, he found his wheel. He loves his saucer. Um, today, the also the day I got the IKEA, I got the new wheel because I only use saucers because at Petco they only used let him use a four inch saucer, which I also have. But then I transferred a seven point two five inch. Then he found his wheel and he tried to use it because he's never ever used a proper wheel before, which I was really proud of him for trying. And he does use it now, which is amazing, because overnight, last night, he used it. Because we only did this yesterday. And then he went to go burrow for, like, a few seconds. Just to walk around an adventure, you know, like a hamster does. Then he popped out, and it was so cute. Just look at his little face. He is adorable. And he looked around, he went back to his food bowl, but then I didn't record that part. And this is just an overview of his detail for now, and he's way up there, burrowing. And he, like, popped his head out in a few seconds. There he is. He's so cute, wandering around. And um, there's more bedding over there now, so it's around 12 a foot of bedding, because I took out, you'll see in a, in a few minutes, like in a minute. Da, da, da. So this is the next day where I started to organize all of his hamster stuff into the shelf down below. That's me right there. If you And that's Coco Bean, my cat, if you've never heard of her. She is adorable. She's my pet. And just like Blueberry is, he, they're my personal pets. We have seven pets in total, but those are my personal ones. So we have all of those, which I might do like a tour, like a room tour soon. But I am transferring my room to the basement. And... Um, this winter so I might not and then the, I decided to do the sand bath because I realized I didn't have one because I forgot to put one in so I cleared out mostly everything it didn't really matter to clear out everything in that part so I laid down a bunch of paper towels so it didn't leak out or anything and then so then it's easy to clean up too so then I laid out the sand and I used um, put the wheels in and I used his chew toys to for a border because I do not have a log bridge right now so but that's okay 
Then this is an overview of the top. Yes, my dad made those lids by himself, which was absolutely amazing of him. Love him so much. If my parent, if it wasn't for my parents, we 